and Commons. Now, still on the news, the Ogun State Commissioner for Environment, Abiodun Balogun, says the government is constructing 600 public toilets across the state as part of moves to put open defecation under control. Balogun equally hinted that the government will launch Operation Remove Abandoned Vehicles in order to get rid of burned and abandoned vehicles, which according to him, have all criminals and aid open defecation. He made this known while briefing newsmen and activities of the ministry. The commissioner explained that the government had allocated funds to construct 100 toilets, while additional 500 will be jointly constructed by the state and a foreign organization. Speaking on flooding, he said the government has commenced distilling and clearing drainages as dredging of rivers to curb flood disaster. He vowed that the government would close down illegal dump sites while urging residents to make use of the government's designated refuge dump sites. On pollution and emission, the governor accused companies of failure to adhere strictly to the rules and regulation on pollution control. He said the government would continue to wield big sticks as many of the industries were not ready to embrace peaceful admonition. The government on its own is planning to construct public toilets all over the state so as to check this open defecation pro uh, uh, problem. We are planning, uh, we have um, plans, uh, we are pr probably working, we are planning to work with a, a foreign, uh, uh, what do you call it, foreign organization to construct about 500 toilets in the state. So we hope that we're able to perfect that. And in addition to that, we also have it in our budget <coughs> to also construct, um, I think, 100, 100 toilets as well this year. In the meantime, the Ogun State government has discharged 40 persons in contact with the Italian national tested positive for 